Hello everyone, Chopper Gaming here, welcome back to my channel. Today we're playing Zombie.io, I'm going to give you the best starter team you can be using to be pushing into the chapter as well as going to be helping you with all the dungeons that is available into the game. So the first team we're going to be talking is actually, we're starting with your main hero, the agent or the character you're playing with. This is the one that's going to be sticking with you forever. And then we're having the extra heroes that is a team we're going to be working on. We're starting the first one going to be Harley Rebel Girl. The reason of why she's the best to be using is because of her skill. Her skill launch lightning chain, it continually bouncing between targets. So she's not just attacking one target, she's attacking multiple targets. The higher the level the skill gonna be, the more targets she will be attacking. And when evolving it to the max skill, the damage is greatly increased and it can attack all enemies within her range. And you can check here the preview this is the skill she got. And yeah, she's not a free hero to be getting. Basically, you're getting her for the first time top up. Like if you do a $1 top up, you're going to get this hero. She's really great hero and she's really worth it. The next one going to be Uncle Drew. The reason of why he's the best to be using in the start of the game because of his skill. He's swinging the hammer he got and it's doing two things. The first one to be damaged to the enemies within this range and the second is actually blocking the skills from the enemies. Some skills from the bosses as well get blocked but not all of them. Check the preview of it. You see he's swinging this hammer around. The higher the level the faster it's going to be the long range and going to be. Really he's a great hero to be using in the start as well and you can see when evolving him the team attack gonna be increased by 20 and the max HP by 100 too. Next one going to be a healer hero, Sasha. She's a healer mainly focusing on healing the team and at the same time she's dealing damage. Her skill launch a heart shaped missile to attack the nearest enemy while healing allies. At the same time when the ultimate max, Sasha gonna be causing extra range explosion after hitting a unit with her projectile. And we check the review of the skill, launch a heart shaped missile. This one gonna be attacking this hero, the enemy here, and it bounces as well between them, and it heals as well herself and the team. So really a great team to be using. We're trying to be balancing between damage dealing, defense, and healing as well. If you don't want to be spending that dollar to get Harley, then I'll say you can use either Hatasha for the damage dealing using a sniper in the early stage when you have in the ultimate skill to the max the sniper going to be changed to a laser and the laser gonna be dealing high damage to the enemy continuously it's focusing on just a single target so she's a great one for the close combat or you can use the other one gonna be molly with her shotgun She's a great one for the AoE damage, especially in some dungeons. So yeah, this is a great team I'm using that far. I have been able to be pushing further in all the aspects in game. I'm in chapter 9. And at the same time, I'm trying to work around in everything in this game. So this is the best team you can be using in the start of the game. Either if you're a free player or you are a low spender, it will be helping you to be pushing into the game and it's not really that hard so make sure guys to like the video subscribe to the channel write to me in the comments if you're having any other team or any other heroes that you think is really suitable to be using in the early stage i'll be more than happy to hear your opinions and your comments make sure to be subscribing to the channel as well to not be missing my videos in the future till then take care and have a happy gaming time